So let's start with the number two thirds. That's a fraction. Let's remember terminology. Two at the top of the fraction is called the numerator. Three at the bottom of the fraction is called the denominator. What does two thirds mean? Well, it means that you have taken something, some whole unit, divided it into three equal pieces and taken two of them. So in this rectangle, we can see that, right? We have divided the rectangle into three pieces and we've taken two of them and colored them in. Similarly, on our number line, we can take that unit from zero to one, divide it into three pieces and take two of them, and so here at A is where two-thirds sits on the number line, two pieces out of three. If we take this group of hearts, we can see two-thirds there by doing what we always do. We divide into one, two, three absolutely equal parts, and then we choose to take two of those equal parts, so that group of hearts here is two-thirds of the whole lot of hearts. Okay, check that you've got these basic ideas. In your homework book, you've got these pictures. And what I want you to do is shade in three-tenths, two-fifths, or nine-twentieths of those rectangles. Just pause the video and do it now. Okay, you should have had a picture something like this. For three-tenths, you need to cut this rectangle up into 10 equal pieces, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 pieces of the same size, and then you take 1, 2, 3 of them. For the fifths, for two fifths, you need to cut the rectangle up into 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 pieces, and then you take two of those pieces. And for 9 twentieths, well, the rectangle has already been cut up into these little pieces, and there are 20 of them, and then you need to color in nine of them, so that's four, eight, nine of them. So you'd have a picture something like that.